What I'm going to talk about now is a scrapbooking kit. I'm going to do an unboxing. I really like this one. It's got all those lovely muted colours that, uh, that I really like. It's a 12 inch by 12 inch scrapbooking album kit and there are over 1,000 pieces in here. So it's really, it was really quite good value because I think it was about $16. So it's got assorted embellishments to, uh, to make your scrapbook come alive. So what I'm going to do is to undo this and let's have a look at what we've managed to get. It says it's for people three years of age and up. Can't imagine a three-year-old doing scrapbooking, but I guess they do. And of course, any younger than that, and they swallow the pieces. Okay. It's just beautiful. Ooh, it looks like everything's stuck together. Got all that gum attaching everything to each other. So these are buttons of different shapes and sizes. sound. Okay, and everything's got a sticky back on it, so it will stick nicely to your, your paper as you do your design. So we have some buttons. These are just beautiful. I look lovely and bring the pages to life. And see, everything's sticking to each other. Then we've got the little bird, butterfly, a dragonfly, they're always very popular, and a clock. They're very lovely and put together beautifully so you don't have to do that yourself. You can just pull it off and stick it to the page. And here we've got our alphabet and numbers, a few other things like exclamation marks and question marks. I've certainly used a strong adhesive on these, I'm not pulling apart very well at all. So, oh, that's really nice. We've got lowercase and a fancy script. And we've got lowercase and a more boxy type script. 
and then our capital letters. So that's going to be very nice for adding words and names to our pages. And here's some decorative strips to go around the page you can have them just on the top or the bottom whatever suits you beauty of scrapbooking is it's entirely up to you what you decide to do so let's have a look at what we've got here right got the one with the wavy bottom or top depending how you want to use it of course We've got a nice little polka dot piece. This one here has got little butterflies as embellishments, so that will make a nice feature. Again, just another straight piece reminiscent of old type wallpaper. And then a lacy piece. It looks like lace on a hessian background. So they will all make nice additions to our page. It's fun always looking at all these beautiful things that you get in the kit. So many people do scrapbooking nowadays. It's such a fun way to keep reminders of holidays or family or just your favourite hobby. You can take photos and mount them. Okay, here we have some more cards. This one has a lacy effect. It's very pretty. These you can just pop out which bits you, you want to use. It's all out and if you wanted to you could leave that there and just use the whole thing again it's entirely up to you you have another piece it's got cut pieces for so that you can use just the bits that you want and take that out you can put a photo behind there lovely pink edging and we can pop out pieces it's very attractive the pink with the lace around it see how easy it pulls apart if you're doing one for a man so maybe there's you've got a fisherman or a hunter in your family you can use the darker colors you don't have to be fishermen or hunters of course they can be car enthusiasts but the brown would suit a male page Certainly quite a selection in here. As I said, I think there's a thousand pieces altogether. A lovely piece with the rose and the spots. I like the colours. I think the pale pink is just beautiful. I guess it's more a lilac colour than it is a pink. It's like a picture frame, an old fashioned type picture frame sort that normally was painted gilt. This one's painted purple. Again, another fairly masculine looking one in the dark brown. These are all reminiscent of old wallpapers. 
And if you've got a musician in the family, he's gone with musical notes on it. Now we have some larger card. I'm just hoping that noise is not too loud for you. lowercase letters and you've got a few of each so that uh, you're not going to run out there's only two of the Z's but I don't think too many people use a lot of Z you've got three Y's mm, that's a bit unusual so. okay so we've got two there's a the uppercase characters these are all very beautiful very it feels lovely nice quality and these would go with your masculine theme and it's a uppercase and the lower case more embellishments this kit certainly is uh, has got a lot in it feel the quality you can maybe be able to hear how solid it is and again all of these little embellishments pop out easily than others obviously it's nice to have a uh, something to keep these in so we need to get a storage container for all these little bits so they don't get lost and you can take that out and then you can you can break it down into as many pieces as you like really We've got beautiful butterflies and the lovely swirling edges. I'm going to have a lot of fun with this kit, I can see that. Birds, clocks of different sizes. Very beautiful. And of course we've got some sayings and memories, which is what scrapbooking's about. It's about making beautiful memories for your family. There we go, moments we have shared, our story. Back in the day, I can remember lots of things that were back in the day. Things that a lot of the young folk don't remember nowadays, don't know about. Before the days of iPods. We have another sheet of various type characters, they're all uppercase. More numbers, question marks. Oh, sorry, exclamation marks. There's a question mark. Mm. This looks exciting. We've got some really nice pieces in here. Let's make a nice crinkly sound. Thank you. 
sound. However, I better stop playing and get on with my unboxing. So, what have we here? Now, what we have here are some sh more sheets that go into our scrapbook. And we have the first two are just beautiful. They've got lace and roses. I actually have one of these lace tablecloths. And this these are potpourri sachets and some old-fashioned writing but they're just beautiful and delicate and so nice for a nostalgia scrapbook and these are very delicate with a wash through them and give some darker darker highlights and there's some beautiful flowers in amongst those these would be lovely to make for a mother or grandmother to make a scrapbook for one of their those people they love this sort of thing and this one here reminds me a little bit of a an old-fashioned film it's got that washed out look in the in the middle oh, old-time movies old-time pictures And lovely swirls, all very nostalgic looking. There's two sheets of each of these, and the quality is just beautiful. This is going to make a beautiful scrapbook. The set, they've got beautiful flowers in the middle, oh, sorry, in the middle, on the side. You could have them facing however you like. That's the beauty of scrapbooking. Is there are no rules. The rule you're only governed by your own imagination, your own tastes, and your own likes. Nothing's wrong. There are no wrong methods in scrapbooking. And here we have music for the music lover. It's very really washed out looking, old fashioned looking music sheets. I wonder if this is a song I know don't read music so I won't know and here we have some very small writing I can't make out many of the words there's one that says be your love It's like an old-fashioned letter, old-fashioned writing. And make a lovely background. And this is reminiscent again of the old-fashioned wallpapers. And the reason that I say this is because we had a gold colour wallpaper when I was young. And it was the exact same pattern as this. So... It's very reminiscent of the old days. And this reminds me of a material. It's got little bubbles on it. And I think they used to call it seersucker, but I, I could be wrong. Candy stripers. And our last two sheets kind of look like they've been stained with tea and they have the lace down the side which is very beautiful and again it's up to you how you have it the beauty of it being square as it goes anyway so all of these papers are going to make a really nice finished product now here we are we've reached our for our book that's really beautifully finished off
nothing exciting to see. I just like the sound of the pages turning. Oops. that's going to make a beautiful beautiful scrapbook of course we have the box and we keep everything nice and neat Everything fits nice and neat in here. And we can make up the beautiful memories and family moments that we share. Scrapbook. So I hope you've enjoyed seeing all the beautiful pieces that are in our, our kit. So I think that's, uh, that's about it for me. Just put these larger sheets in. Do love this. Can't wait to get started. Thank you for watching. <laughs>